Welcome back to the fucking show. Welcome back, guys. Mario, this is Gameaholics. Mario is still sprinting vigorously without a bead of sweat. Not even a single bead of sweat. Look deep into his eyes. I'm not gonna get you. Here we go. <laughs> I'm yeah. gonna get you. Here we go. I'm gonna fuck you. I'm gonna heads. put you in the cow zone. I'm gonna put you in a coma. <laughs> I'm gonna jump on your head. <laughs> Yahoo! I'm gonna kill you like I did the Koopas. <laughs> I'm the millions of shit. Koopas I've died, I've killed it's before. It's me, Golden Mario. <laughs> he just, did you see what I just did? That Koopa was about to like, I'm going home. And Mario's and like, just no! Like, no! <laughs> <laughs> and he just stomped. Yeah, just like that. He just like stomped, stomped on the shelf. Stomped on his ace. You know, I'm pretty glad I didn't know. These guys are fucking assholes. You just kicked me out of my fire flower. And, or, or not fire flower. What the fuck? Take, take it out. Take it out. Take it out. Nah, Damn. Now we're good. Yes, kitty. And what what do you want, Casper? He's like, Ray! No. He's like, Guy! Oh, I think you're gonna get shot out of a cannon again. This I need to pee. <laughs> he just tells you, I need to pee. <laughs> what if that's what his voice What if that's wow, what Wow, I thought you were about to get taken <laughs> yeah, out. Me too. What if that's what his voice was like? He's oh, like, he's like guys! Oh shit, man! I need fucking dying! <laughs> oh, man! <laughs> oh, look where I'm at! I hope one of us, like, I I hope it's you. I'm sorry, but I I don't want to puke. But <laughs> I hope one day you vomit while we're recording. <laughs> That would be great for business. I say you because I hate vomiting. I think we both hate it, but I'd rather it not be me. <laughs> I think that's probably the case for both of us. That's oh. the case for everybody that has a body. True. They'd I'm... rather not vomit. <laughs> yeah, vomiting is like... <laughs> it's not so it's much... It's just inconsiderate. <laughs> it's inconsiderate towards yourself. <laughs> It's inconsiderate, yeah, towards yourself. Good. Hey, you remember to restart- Oh, fucking bitch. You remember to restart the timer yes, this time, right? Oh, okay. You know, like, the last two episodes, you forgot to restart it. We were just playing without the timer going. We're gonna have, like, two 15-minute con- What? No. Oh, that's right, we didn't beat this one yet. Mm -mm. We're probably gonna have, like, two 15-minute episodes consistently. Because for some reason, I'm yeah. having problems beating this level. <gasps> oh, <laughs> shit. Oh, I couldn't jump in time. Ah, uh, it's okay. Oh, yeah. I want to drink more alcohol, so I'm good at this game. Ah, but yeah, the Steel Reserve tastes. Ah. Good. It it's better than Flying Dog. If if you've ever tried Flying Dog, guys, it's it's so bad. Like it actually it made my penis hurt. <laughs> like to to put it into realistic perspective for you, it tastes like earwax. Actual earwax. They keep saying that I have not tried this brand, <clears throat> but uh, I'll tell you, I won't. <laughs> <laughs> it it really does because uh, last weekend me and Roxy. I'm on my secret mission. Yeah, last weekend me and Roxy we went to Corridor Wine and Liquor, and it's like which is a really nice. Wine it's place it's so around. big. It's like it's a basically a warehouse the size of like the Interstate Batteries place me and Joey's worked at. We both work at or we both used to work at Interstate Maybe Batteries. Company. Whatever, it doesn't matter. We're not we're not we're not sponsoring these companies anyway. We're uh, not talking trash. I forgot you could just fucking kill them by hitting the bottom. Mm. Oh, that's so fucking simple. Oh. Mm. So yeah, um, it, it's about the size of like, you know, a decent warehouse, but it's just a giant fucking liquor store and it has like eight checkout lines and you just show your ID at each checkout line. People like go in there with shopping carts and it's just, it's fucking huge. For liquor. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's like a Walmart of liquor stores. It's crazy. In the best way possible, <laughs> by yeah. the way. And it gives you the best prices because they buy all their liquor in bulk, but anyway. Point is, I, I went there and I bought like a little sampler because they have like a lot of the tiny ones that you can buy. And it was uh, one of the flying dog brands. And this one was called, uh, I think it was 
flying snake or something, or it, there was like some sort of worm. Earwax. <laughs> it's just plain. Ear- I would have believed plain it. Plain called earwax. So uh, basically, I I got it and just to try it, and I was like, oh, this is so funny because the name was like Raging Bitch. Or, I, there was one called Raging Bitch that was also really terrible. So <laughs> um, so I got it. It was like a flying like snake dog thing, and I thought the name was funny. I can't remember what it was. So I try it, and I'm like. I look to Roxy, and I'm like, oh, this tastes like earwax. And then Roxy, uh, she's like, let me try. And she goes, oh my god, I thought you were just joking and, like, exaggerating. And I was like, oh, it's just going to be kind of beer-like. And, but you know what? It's actually exactly earwax. It tastes exactly like earwax. <laughs> and she just went on for, like, ten minutes in detail about how much, like, earwax it tasted. <laughs> And I wish I could remember those details, but I am not sober right now, so I'm not going to. True. <laughs> well, it looks like I got a Yoshi. Joel, your turn. I like how Yoshi looks really, like, at peace about determined. his life. <laughs> no, not determined at all. Oh, actually, he's the actually, exact opposite. <laughs> actually, this little sprite of Yoshi right here with Luigi on him looks really fucking worried and scared. Like, his eyes are wide open. <laughs> The <laughs> truth finally comes out. I really <laughs> hope he doesn't pull out my cervix with his huge Italian dick. <laughs> oh god. I heard about that shit happening before. Oh yeah, tell the I mean I've hit the back before, but I've never ever ripped out a girl's cervix. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Damn it. Getting pretty vulgar. Oh sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't give a fuck. The more vulgar the better. Fuck. Oh, tell the story about the guy with two dicks while I'm, well, while I'm concentrating on this part. Well, apparently, I've, there's an autobiography about this guy with two dicks going around. And uh, one part of the story was he was just going to town on this girl. And she and he asked her, um, Hey, uh, I, I, I got a second dick. You, you want it in? She was like, fuck yeah. And he just goes to town on her with two of them in there. And then all of a sudden, she stops making noise, and he's like, wow, she's really getting wet, because it's just getting wetter and wetter down there in the groin area. And he's just like, what? What's going on? And he, like, looks down, and he's found out that her fucking cervix came out. That's so fucked up. And he just saw her, and she wasn't really making any... She was just, like, with her eyes kind of just rolled up and she's just like not making any noise so, so he just decides to finish up in her and just go <laughs> that is such a fucked up story <laughs> that, is, that was a tr- true story by the way that like, is a true story about the guy with two dicks yeah he he <laughs> he has a rare condition apparently Yes. And, um, and I didn't think it was real when I first heard it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if you can be born with two heads or like and have conjoined twins, then I mean, why not? That's pretty much he. I mean, that he does pretty much have. That's the same condition. I mean, he, the ovum started to split. Two just, heads. Yeah. Yeah. But fuck. Look at how gigantic these skeletons are. Like, look, I am a full-grown human being, assumably in this game, and there is a giant, like, seven-foot-tall turtle skeleton walking at me. Like, if I were Mario, I would just cower in the corner and be like... That you are able to drink... That you are able to... Oh, fuck. To <laughs> shit. Take out... Kyle. I couldn't move because I was crouched and I was trying Damn to... It. <laughs> oh, I was uh, making jokes instead of playing the game. I'm sorry, guys. That was probably... I used all, all that progress. It's um, alright, man. It's alright. We got this. It's alright. We got this. We got this. I like how Yoshi's face squints like when you pull this. He's like, I can't hold it anymore. <laughs> He pukes. He looks like an actual drunk girl. <laughs> a flying drunk girl. Like... Oh, I can't swallow it. Okay. God, I'm never having Jaeger and, and Mountain Dew again. Well, that was a waste of <laughs> fucking time. <laughs> I thought this was actually going to be useful, but it was not. I'm oh, sorry, the, guys. Oh, the wings? No, um, getting... I, I thought there was a secret in this game, but there wasn't. Or a secret in this one, but there wasn't. 
Oh, oh, you went to the same So, level. all right, your turn, Mario. Okay. All right, so now I'm not going to crouch like a baby and get killed by fucking dinosaurs again. Wait. These, these things are nerve-wracking. What? Whatever, whatever. Freaking... Okay, you're going to take this guy at which castle? I don't know. Fucking... But so Joey was, in case you want to know what that silence was, Joey was pulling out his phone like, wait, it's been 10 minutes, you know? <laughs> <And> I'm like, <laughs> well, we've had like 15 minute episodes the past two, so. Yeah. I mean, it's okay, though. If people can sit here and listen to us, <laughs> we love you. <laughs> yeah, th thank you for tolerating our stupid bullshit. <laughs> like me crouching and just like accepting defeat from that. Accepting defeat from that fucking uh, Koopa, that skeleton Koopa. I didn't even mean to. The controller <laughs> sounds like it's adjusting. It's like a it's a boat adjusting to weight or some shit. It's adjusting to, to no, how no. fucking stupid I am. It's like I have to take some time and get used to this stupid bullshit. You could have just taken him out for good. Oh, from the bottom, right? <gasps> <laughs> oh shit! I That's was like, why I was like, <gasps> yeah. No. Like, I know that when you're gasping, it's like, oh no, Joey remembers this from his childhood. What's about <laughs> to happen? <laughs> and then I saw it's that some the, bad shit's about to happen. Yeah, I, I thought I had some room from those two little blocks, and then I was like, oh shit, those two blocks are in the way of the wall, and I'm gonna get fucked. One thousand points. The 1,000 points, it don't matter. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like, what does it do? I think if you, I think maybe it unlocks something at the end of the game if you, if you get a lot of it. If you get 10,000 points, doesn't it give you... Does it give you a 1-up when you get 10,000 points? I'm not sure. I haven't really noticed that. I just noticed you have 10 lives. Yeah, I've been getting extra lives. <laughs> I went to the extra levels. I let you levels. go fuck yourself. I went to the extra levels like a, a normal person. But... A normal person <laughs> doesn't doesn't play this game. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that's true. At least modern normal people. Yeah, they're not fun. People, people, <laughs> no... people that listen to Arcade Fire. <laughs> Did you say Arcade Fire? <laughs> yeah. What the hell is that? Uh, I don't. I don't even fucking know. Hipsters. <laughs> just... Hipsters don't listen to this song. Or fuck? don't listen to this shit. You don't- that was just- it just sounds so original though. Arcade Fire. I'm a little drunk right now, you gotta- Shut your fucking trap. I'm- You're- You're original. I'm getting more orders. Hey! Can you- can you give me the rest of the monster in there? I- This is I, my second monster, wait. I haven't even drank my first monster, I've had Colt 45, or whatever the fuck it is. Oh! Yeah, bitch, give me that shit. There you go. You've hardly had anything at all to drink. There we go, buddy. <laughs> You're just like, don't let the audience know. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm a little more drunk than he is. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Oh, we get right at the little Koopa Goo. Yeah, we're at the Koopa Goo. <laughs> I love the the pause. I'm gonna have another another two of them. The, I love. Look at his face. He's like, and he's just. Like, Look at him! Look at his little <laughs> his little feet. <laughs> oh, I love him. I used to be scared of the scared of these guys too. Fucking cheap ass motion tweening, just stretching the same sprite image. I actually, I don't know about you. But I love the old stuff. I, well, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, I don't know about you, but but I I really am not a fan of motion tween animation, and. I know you're not an animator. I'm, I'm animating a cartoon, by the way. But yeah, I don't. I know you. You don't animate, but like, motion tweening is basically where you copy and paste the same picture, or like stretch it mm -hmm. frame by frame, so that you don't have to draw it over and over. You can just like copy and paste it in different positions to each frame as it goes. But it just it looks fucking weird. It just looks like a paper cutout is moving around, <laughs> and I don't like it. Like, well. <laughs> We're Gameholics, <laughs> and that's the end of this episode. Yep. <laughs> we'll get to see what's in uh, Vanilla Doom. Yeah, next next uh, episode. In the next episode. I shit on a different type of animation other than motion tweeting. 
So, uh, Vanilla Dome number one will be coming up to you in the next installment of Gameaholics. Like, comment, subscribe. Don't comment hate. We'll delete you. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> delete you from or if you from the internet.